we got to get to the next one. This one kind of slept on a little bit, right? Shakur yeah. Stevenson, Oscar Valdez, the WBO, WBC World Super Featherweight titles on the line. Shakur Southpaw at minus 600. Oscar Valdez, definitely the sleeper at plus 340. Who do you have for this one, Brian? The smart bet here is Shakur Stevenson to win on points, which is at minus 140 right now. For people who don't know, Shakur Stevenson is getting Floyd Mayweather comparisons, very young Floyd Mayweather comparisons, both in style and production. He gets grief for being boring, but he's going to counterpunch Oscar Valdez's death. Oscar Valdez's hope is, because he gives up more rounds, is to be aggressive, and that's going to play right into Shakur Stevenson's hands. I think it's going to be a counterpunching clinic, kind of like what we've seen from Terrence Crawford, who Shakur Stevenson also trains with and reminds people of. So I think that's going to be the smart bet here. If you do want a late stoppage, though, Stevenson to win in rounds 9 through 12, which is possible, plus 750 right now. I think I might sprinkle on that for a little value. I like that value for that one because I think Shakur Stevenson will eventually be way too much for Asker Valdez. When you look at Valdez's fight against Canseo, he kind of struggled in that bout where at one point you were thinking, hey, is Robson going to win this bout? So that'll be a little bit interesting. But Shakur Stevenson, like you mentioned, comparisons to Money Mayweather. And most importantly, his shoulder roll D looks just like Money Mayweather. Yeah. So he's got that high IQ. He's a great body puncher, great defensively. And guys barely touch him will oscar valdez be able to touch shakur stevenson i gotta roll with shakur by unanimous decision at minus 140 but by tko or ko at plus 260 that's where the value is for shakur and be sure people when you watch the fights bet with FanDuel sportsbook just make sure to do it responsibly take care and enjoy the fights